Welcome to Automotive Engineers Corner. Short video to show you the difference between the project and the process. Uh, in the last videos you saw already um, explanations of uh, both, what is the process and what is the project. Now I will explain you the difference. The thing is, both are sets of uh, activities. But then look, project project is only on one uh, is only one time and it's defined in time it's defined as well in uh, terms of deliverable so for example the project needs to start it will be a set of activities activity 1 can be design activity 2 can be production In the meantime, there will be some testing. Then it will be, uh, why not, marketing and sales. And this will have an end. For example, 30th of 06 2020 and it will start the kickoff of the project the first meeting of the project will be at 1st of March 2020 so you have the set of activities and it's going like this and here and there and somehow the people need to work and then it start and it then it, it's finished. That's it. Whereas the process, actually it doesn't have any time constraint. It just needs to have the activities. So we can have a design process. And actually it has an input, for example, of a concept. And it has an output, which will be, for example, a drawing or a 3D model. Then for example we have the process of testing. Therefore I will see here processes. Testing. As an input it can have a sample, prototype, or serial product and after the testing the output would be for example test report then we can have the production process it's quite easy to understand why production process will have as input actually the drawing what I need to what I need to produce the actual drawing needs to be fee fed into the production process. Uh, then the materials, so the components, can be the input. And then production will be the finished or final product. For marketing and so on, you can have processes, endless processes. For marketing, you can have a process as well. We can talk about it later as well. Sales, of course, you will have processes. With some input, with some outputs. It can be more outputs. It doesn't need to be one, out, one output or one input. But you see, uh, the, the process itself is a set of activities, but it's in whatever time. The same of production processes, for example. It's just the daily job, the daily job that needs to be repeatably, repeatably um, executed. And then spit out some results. Take the inputs, spit out the results. So this is for, for everything. It's a set of activities. You need to do this, then do that, do that, maybe parallel do this, and so on, and so on. And then you spit out the thing, uh, the spit uh, out the, the final product. So, 
this is the point where project can have many can involve many processes but a process doesn't involve doesn't take a project inside so we can say a project is kind of a process but it's really limited in time in resources where a process is a set of activities to achieve a several goal thousand times million times so this is the difference between a process and a project project is a set of uh, set of activities in a limited time with limited resources with a limited team a process is just a defined the set of activities with input and output and that's it see you next time